What up? YouTube! Lamar Fashion back again, and we're going to crack some vintage cars today. I want to start by giving a big shout out to my big, my good big brother, Champion DJK. Thank you so much for taking up my little personal challenge and cracking some very difficult cars. And uh, I'm going to kind of follow in kind. I don't collect chase pieces. I just collect cars. I, I like cars, so that's why I do this. I'm not into trying to um, one-up somebody in some competition. Uh, I work out for that. And uh, so I don't have to get my kicks over some stupid hobby. But here we go. I'm going to crack some vintage pieces. And we're going to start with some black walls. We've got some black walls and some Tomica for you today. And whoo-hoo. I've been looking for this one for a while. Found it on a cut card. I think I paid five bucks for this. Let's take a look at this thing. Um, really quick around the back. We've got an 82 date. And this was back when their offices were in Hawthorne, California. I would have been five years old. That's pretty cool. Let's free the peace. Shout out to Champion DJK, who used to collect Hot Wheels. He's grown past all that. Good for him. But let's get this minty beast out of here. Shout out to you, uh, Count Five. I know you like this thing, and look at this. If you're over the age of 35, you probably remember these things rolling around on the road. What a clunker. But they're really cool. We'll take a look at the casting. Completely flawless. This thing is heavy. These were quality, quality toys back in the day. And they're really good rollers, too. Take a look at the base. Not a hint of toning. Just completely minty, 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 minty. Love it. Add that to the Free for Peace collection. I've got another one. Really, really cool. Been looking for this one for a long time. I want to get it out, see if it actually has a plastic body. It's weird. Anyway, here we go. The Jaguar XJS on an unpunched card. Isn't that nice, you guys? I love carded collectors. Let's take a look at the back of the card, which takes up a lot of space and is made of paper. So I don't like that. We've got a 79 date on there. Really sweet. This thing is older than most of you watching this. We're going to free the piece on the uncut card because unpunched card because I don't give a care about those things. Here we go. What a piece. Let's see. It's kind of dusty. I guess it has a metal body. You guys comment below. I can't really tell. I'm old. But what a sweet piece. Another cool black wall to add to the collection. I won't be collecting too many of these. I really want uh, hot ones, in particular silver hot ones. Um, so if you want to raid my Auto World collection, that's a good way to do it. That and Tomica is a good way to get Auto World off me. Now, the stuff I collect, and for Ford Friday, hashtag Ford Friday, have I got a little beastie for you guys. This is the Lotus 78 formula. This is powered by a Ford engine, so I don't want to hear anything from you nons who don't know anything about anything. This is the 78 Lotus Formula 1, the John Player Special. Let's take a look at it. I love these Tommy Pocket cars. The date is in Roman numerals. For you nerds, you can translate that. Very, very cool. Let's free the piece. Chris, I know... You've been looking forward to this one. That's, of course, if I can get it out of the blister. Is this blister taped? No, it's not. It's just really in there. This is so awesome, you guys. <laughs> I love these vintage toys. I'm going to have to wipe this thing down. It's covered in dust. But there's your vintage Formula One racer. The stickers, yes, those are stickers on the side, are still intact. It's got a plastic base, very lightweight. I bet this thing is an awesome roller. The Tomicas typically run or roll better than the Hot Wheels. There's your 78 Ford, made in Japan. That's casting F36 for foreign 36. That's awesome. 
glad to have a Ford for this video. It is Friday. Now, I've got two really special pieces. I'm going to show them both to you first in the packaging. I don't know which one to crack first. This one is just a JDM collector's dream. Shout out to all you fake JDM collectors who collect Hot Wheels and think they're JDM. They are not. They are USDM. If the wheels are on our side, that means it was sold in this market. That's what it means. Just because the car is made by a Japanese manufacturer does not mean anything. Now, this thing's on a bad card. So we're going to get it out of here. I would have cracked it anyway. When I first started watching this thing, it was like at $200. I wasn't going to do that, so I talked the guy way, 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 way down and got a good deal on this. I managed to get out of Dodge for about 35 bucks. Shipped to my house. What an awesome piece. UCC coffee. Very, very Japanese on your Bluebird. Let's take a look at the base Nissan Bluebird wagon. This is casting 34 and 160 scale. Made in Japan, you guys. What is actually made in Japan nowadays? It does have an opening lift gate. There we go. I know you guys love your opening features. It snaps back really nice. That is just completely The UCC coffee, very Japanese. Love it. Love it. Let's keep going. And finally, you guys, this thing I don't know. I, I scarcely, I don't know how I do this. Oh, we'll just get to it. By Tomika, marketed under Tomi Pocket Cars for our market, the Rolls Royce Phantom. Guys, seriously, this thing is completely oozing. Completely ridiculous. Once again, around the card, it shows you the different castings available in the assortment. 74 day on this one, you guys. We're taking it way back. Let's free the piece. This thing has been in the blister way, way, way too long. And it shows on the casting. I'm going to have to buff this thing out. But here we go. This is the first Rolls Royce I've ever cracked on my channel. And since I started collecting little cars, <laughs> this thing is so awesome. It's got opening doors. Do both doors? No. But both doors open on both sides. These would have been suicide doors, as far as I recall. When asked how much power does it have, they'd say adequate. Made in Japan, the Rolls-Royce Phantom 6. Absolutely amazing in 178 scale. This gives you an idea of what a great big hulking behemoth this thing is. Completely awesome, you guys. Just wanted to crack some really cool vintage pieces for you guys. And I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or any comments, please leave those below. And feel free to subscribe. Thank you to new, all new subscribers. Take care, everybody. God bless you and your families. Audi 5000.